again, uh, almost like a second pre-season. Um, yeah. What's it like to be back? Uh, no, obviously it's, um, it's good to be back with everything's going on, but it's just a bit up in the air at the minute with everything's going on. So um, it does, like you said, it does feel like another pre-season, but hopefully this is a bit shorter than the other pre-season. Hopefully we get back to soon. Yeah, I mean, obviously obviously having a sudden break in the season. What was it like trying to stay on top of things and try and keep sort of the momentum going? Um, to be fair, it went um, it went as hard for me as most other boys because obviously I'm from Wales and then everything was still open as usual. When you lot was still in lockdown, so it went too bad. But whereas like uh, trying to train team wise, that was that was the toughest part. Like so, there's nothing like playing the game, is there? Yeah, I mean, with the, with the first time of the season, obviously your first first spell with Taunton. Um, getting a goal at the end there against Crowe, must have been pleased to get a goal. Yeah, um, I was buzzing to score. Like, I think it was a couple of games coming like where I possibly could have scored, where I missed chances and whatnot. But um, no, I was, I was happy to score. Like, I was happy uh, I was happy to get the score sheet, but just disappointed with the result in that game, that's all. And uh, obviously, with, with some uncertainty, obviously the extension of. Um, the league is still being cancelled and um, not sure when it'll be back again. What's it like trying to go through that and trying to sort of get prepared for whenever it will start? Um, I think the toughest part about it, like you said, is, is not knowing when we're going to start back. Uh, like if they said the start did 100% going to happen, I think it would be a lot easier and it would be a lot better for the boys because you, you can get psyched up because you know when you're going back. But at the minute it's kind of like it could be next week, it could be January, it could be any time. So. It's, it's, it's tough for them and it is tough to get going. Like, but. Yeah, I mean, obviously, as you said, coming from Wales um, into a new side as well. What, obviously, getting to know all the players, what was it like with that? Uh, to, to be fair, all the boys made it quite easy. Like, um, I knew Lee Lucas. I had a uh, spell with him with me for two seasons ago, so I knew Lee at the start. But to be fair, all the other boys just welcomed to my family, so it was good, it was easy. And yeah, it was just, just easy to fit into. Well, it's brilliant to hear you're uh, settling in and uh, we'll speak to you again soon. Cheers, thank you. Well, Elias, first of all, welcome to Taunton Town. Um, coming into strange circumstances, how's it been sort of settling in? Yeah, it's been good. Uh, first session last week, first friendly last week. Um, enjoying myself, it's, it's, uh, it's a good group of lads. Gaff is great, coaches are great, so um, you know, it's how I think well. Uh, obviously, you've got Jay as well, that you sort of knew from beforehand. What's it been like? With obviously no football going on currently, trying to get to know the squad. Yeah, it's been like I said, it's been difficult. Not even just getting to know the squad. Obviously, staying fit and that as well. Um, obviously, while we've like, been in, in lockdown in England, I've been, you know, there's been the gyms open in Wales and stuff like that. But match fitness is day, like I said, day is nothing like you know, be it training and playing games and stuff like that. Um, obviously, a new J last year from uh, from playing at Chippenham. Um, but like I said, I'm sort of settling into the squad now and uh, getting to know the lads. It's, it's been yeah, pretty easy. Really. Um, with, with previous experience at this level and level above, uh, and some levels above, um, how, how do you feel that will help going sort of bringing that into the squad? Yeah, uh, I'm still young, but I feel like I said, I've got a lot of experience in my belt now. Last year was great for me, and I played you know games at a level above, and um, I feel like that'll, that'll help. You know, in difficult times in the season, you know when when things do get maybe get on top and the pressure's there, you know I feel like I can you know I can deal with that, and um, I can you know help the squad push forward. And obviously with Rob J. Prey approaching you just before the, um, yeah. the stop to the season, what, what was the thought process in deciding Taunton was the place to be? Great club. Um, like I said, I spoke to Jay about things as well. Um, you know, obviously helped me make my, make my decision, you know, speaking to the gaffer about things, um, you know, the way, the way the team play, you know, the, the ambition of the club as well. And it was a no brainer for me, really. Well, it's brilliant to have you, uh, Elias, and we'll speak to you again soon. Great, thank you. Thank you.